Today, I'm gonna to show you how to make ugali. Okay, I'm using the uh, Quaker white cornmeal today. You can also use uh, something like Masarepa. White cornmeal works quite nicely too, but we're using the Quaker today. Okay, so I have two cups of water in the pot, bringing it to a boil with a little pat of butter added, which I like. And I have it on high. As soon as it comes to a boil, I'm gonna turn it down to medium which is boiling right now. I'll turn heat down to medium. I have a cup of the white cornmeal. I'm going to drop it in there and start mixing it. I'll take it off the heat, put it back on the heat. You don't want it bubbling over all over the stove, so you have to keep taking it off. And you gotta mix it pretty vigorously to get it to thicken up pretty well. Make sure you don't leave any dry spots of cornmeal. Back on the heat for a little bit. Take it off for a little bit. We use just slightly less than two cups of water since I added a little butter to it. So it's basically two cups of water and one cup of cornmeal. Starting to thicken up pretty well right now. Once it thickens up, you have to try to form it into a ball or a somewhat ball shaped, anyhow, as good as you can get it. Once it cools, it'll start firming up. Okay. It's pretty thick now, so I'm going to start rolling it around in the pot. Carefully, we roll it out of the pot. Got a pretty nice little shape to it right now. Hope I don't ruin it. The oval shape is mainly for aesthetic appeal. Right? See what it's starting to look like now. And I have it pretty rounded. Try to get it a little smooth on top. And I'm going to put it into the bowl now. And that's what it looks like now. We'll just let it cool down and firm up. I'll cover it with a little uh, plastic wrap. And that's a wrap. Thank you.